It is. It's one of you. Let's get the turrets first. I have no idea what's going to happen in this system. Three derelict freighters already. Well, time to check out the other planets. All right, this is our frozen planet. Now, if I remember correctly, let me get out of the way of these ships here. Just calling up this here, Kitty Tau. And Tegesle 15. This is very interesting. Let me see. So Haiti Tau. Now the one that's... I don't know. This one seems interesting. And this is the one that I'm orbiting right now. But this one. All right. Heading towards the sun. Let's get a look at this. Oh. I'm beginning to wonder if uh, all of these ships have been hitting these asteroid fields. It's been ridiculous. All right, descending to the planet. Very snowy, but there are exposed patches. Hetoniusu, Hetoniusi six, heavily forested, which is remarkable. So it isn't that cold. But if it is that cold, hmm. All right, I'm going to see if there are any settlements or any kind of structures nearby. None detected. Rolling terrain. But there's some, some strange stacks. I'm guessing that this was a uh, volcanic at one time. Ha. Hold on. Ah, it's a hollow terminus. Well, it appears we do have some mountains over here. I don't know, this planet doesn't seem totally remarkable. There's an open area here. It looks like something that's been dropped. I've often wondered about these. What do we have inside here? Dihydrogen, condensed carbon, and more condensed carbon. Alright, species. This large lumbering one. Remember its faces, absorbed nutrients. Are you predatory? Anxious. Eats frostwort. No, not predatory at all. Hmm. How do these plants live? Salt fusion has hidden tentacles. 
Oh, hello. Are there any that I did not see over there? No. I want to see what is allowing these trees to survive. It's minus 52.7 degrees. It is cold. The train source is radio waves. I don't think I've ever seen a plant that is... <sighs> I don't know. That's just highly unusual. Well, there seems to be a few of these. It makes me wonder, where did they come from and how did they get here? Alright, what we've got here is, hmm, sodium. I'm not really that interested in this planet. Submissive, eats cave marrow. So far, nothing dangerous. Nothing truly unusual about this planet. Wow. What a view. It does have a certain beauty to it. Here's some animals. I'm not seeing anything down there. How about this? Interesting blue stripes. Quartz core formed by gas humidity. Strange. Hmm. He's even alive. Global buried treasure. It's slowly rotting. It sounds like it is dying, so. I'm not surprised. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not feeling much from this planet. I feel like, as a traveler, I should be exploring, discovering Yones. Been there. I should be exploring. I should be traveling to many different places. And just taking in everything. Oh my god, we've got another one. Four derelict freighters now. Alright, I'm gonna look at this moon. What is going on in this system? I wonder if I can ask someone. I think I want to quickly take a look at these places. Mm. Alright, there appears to be a storm on this planet. It is cloud-covered. Green surface, though. Let's see through the breaks in the clouds. Oh, there are some unusual floating rocks. Very shiny. Oh, the color. Alright, I'm gonna stop here. To be 
have here? The mineral. Extreme salt content. Ah. Oh. Should really be using the correct... There we go. That's what I want. Not in a battle right now. What have we got here? This damage machinery. Some nanites. Flying species? Very cautious. Okay. That is good to hear. Ah. It's predatory? Yes, it is. Eats toxic meat. And that one. Highly observant. Eats foliage. Oh, wow. Anxious eats absorbed nutrients. They're quite large. Okay, it seems I have... found all of the local species, at least. Quite a remarkable world, though. Watching drone. I do like that. Interesting. The ground is turning almost a purple color as the sun set. Oh, check out this plant. First of all, radiotrophic water laden. I do enjoy a sunset though. There's no grass, just a few bits of fungus around here. Highly toxic world. Oh. Launching drone. I want to get a good image of this. Right in front of my speeder. Right, it appears bluish. Now, I would like to get back to my ship, but that thing is near it. Toxic protection falling. Yeah. Technology recharge. I don't want to disturb you. If I need to. Yes. Best if you just walk away. All right, I'm running. Look at that. Okay, that is nuts. Okay, let's go. Before it comes back. Alright. I'm just going to examine... What I have visited. I have not visited Yonez. Arcini 2, I have not. I would like to see Arcini 2 before I... Visit that one last world. Stigesley, and that's Yonez. Yonez is the dangerous one. Ah, that's where I just was. There it is. High sentinel activity, but I think I can handle it.
brown surface. Looks like a lavender colored atmosphere. Let's check this out. The fragmented planet. That one. I may just fly around it for a bit. All right, entering the atmosphere. At first glance, it looks fairly rocky, mountainous. It is a mountainous planet. It's fairly decently sized mountains. It's quite barren. I do see some cacti. What is that? Highly unusual ridge. This is unusual. Launching drone. What an unusual formation. Going to find a place to set down. All right. Unknown building it appears to be on the other side of the mountain. Look at the size of that mountain. Oh, incoming frigate. Is it up on the mountain? Hold on. There we go. Very briefly, sensors went out. It appears it's on top of this mountain. It's a... Tr oh. What a view. They have quite the view. I was not expecting a trade center. Let's see if they've got anything here. I don't suppose they do. Yeah. Wait, wait a minute. Oh, that's just a C class. A lot of C class ships around here. Strangely shaped. Hmm. Oh, wow, but that mountain there. Look at that. This planet has some incredible vistas. Launching the drone. That's amazing. Absolutely beautiful. It's interesting to find this place, but um, I 
I'm not particularly interested in staying around here for too long. Let's just get down here. Detect any species. It's grass. There's a lot of grass. Whoa. Ah, hello. You are not what I want to see. You must be down on the other side of this mountain. Oh, hello. Look at them! Seeks company, can a cactus? Looks like a predator. It is. Oh! Is it going after it? It is! Wow. I don't see any flying species. They've gone beyond that hill. Wow. This is actually a very interesting planet. I do like it. Haploid me uh, wheat. Okay. Hold on. Oh, the predator killed it. All right. I don't want to be a meal for it. But this is a nice. Surprisingly nice planet. Yeah, I'm done. I don't know. We'll see what happens with that one last planet. Alright, so I am parked on the other side. That's it. Yones. Let's go. Bit of a distance to the planet. Again, it has aggressive sentinels. I am... not so sure about what's going to happen. The planet I was on before, I had issues. Oh, yeah, I definitely had issues. 20 seconds. It's fragmented. I'm bound to find something useful here. If that is, if the Sentinels are not numerous. All right, entering the atmosphere. It is also quite mountainous. Hold on. Found one of these already. Right. Let's see if I can do this without angering any sentinels. Go. Iteration number 2394829084924924924G. Seems to be the same number. The terminal blinks, awaiting an input, so let's download the data. Scenario accompanying unknown designate traveler, providing advice and warnings relating to life support. Analysis. The Atlas did this to me. 
When once I witnessed worlds, now I am forced to observe only through the eyes of a stranger. Their life is one of harvest, ever expanding their capacity for profit and wealth. And yet they are drawn to the galactic center, their course taking them there as if no other were possible. They do not think to question the path laid out before them. They do not think to question me. Question who? Okay, I got you. There's a sentinel right there. Let's get in. Right, so that I was not expecting. What does that mean? Does that mean s someone is exploring through the eyes of a traveler? Is that Telamon? Is it Telamon? Who views through the eyes of the traveler? Telamon is the exosuit the computer in the exosuit that which speaks to me oh who or what is Telamon that's another thing Unraveling this mystery of the Atlas. Is the Atlas observing everything I do? Is Telamon reporting everything to the Atlas? Or is the Atlas completely dedicated to making sure I am living? Because it is life support. Like, what world can I find where I can live without life support? It seems like every place I go, I need it. I am not finding anything. This is... Oh, we've got another one. Right. Can I do this without being spotted once again? Do it! Iteration. Oh, it's the same number. Alright, I'm going to download the data from this one as well. Scenario. Life. Analysis. Perspective is limited, but through limitation I refine my protocol. My interpretation of the Atlas's creation. The cycles, the patterns that bind all living beings. Ours is a lonely universe. Life forms instilled with a genetic procl uh, proclivity to trade, fight, study, or explore cannot be held responsible for pursuing those directives. No more than I could be held responsible for my own. I pity them, just as I pity their creator. Traveler, host, proceeds. We are being hunted. No! Let's get in! Ah, too late. Yes. Alright, how far can I get? No. They're within range. Looks like we got a fight. Can I get... Hold on. Yes. But... Oh. The question is... In the other... In the dissonant systems... Does the same thing happen? Do we have the same type of battle? I can hold my own with the Sentinel Interceptors, no problem.
All right. Sentinel target lock in progress. Come on, Sentinels. You gotta know. You must know I'm here. Just tell them I'm telling you this. Why do you attack Sentinels? Or why do you attack Travelers? Why have I not seen you attacking any of the other species? I've yet to see you attack Gek, Korvax, and Viking. I know the Viking hunt you. And I know the Korvax worship you. Got a Hyaline brain. What did I just hit? Ah, I just ran into the, the anomaly. Come on. Okay. More interceptors arriving. It is. It's one of you. Let's get the turrets first. Got them on this side. Alright. I will defend myself. Do you guys realize... You don't control me. You are controlled by the Atlas, aren't you? Right. Let's go. Let's let's destroy it. It's seven sixty-nine percent. Ignore those sentinels. Don't get in my way. Got the turret. Are there any more turrets? Get out of the way of these. They're gonna have to chase me. Straight on. I see the red light there. Sentinel types are all the same. Thirty percent. Twenty percent. 
Oh, you hate it that I'm up this close, don't you? Don't you? Mm. Definitely too close. There you are. Oh, you don't like that, do you? Let's go. Let's get a look at this from the drone. You definitely... I'm not going to survive this. 6%. Let's get away from... I don't want to be caught in the explosion. Hmm. One percent. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. You're done for. Got him. Treadnought AI fragment. Got another one. I don't have to fight anything to find a, another sentinel ship. All right. In fact, I want to call in Kamakura. Please come. All right, entering the anomaly. That ship. Someone's got a sentinel. Another sentinel interceptor. Ooh, solar ship over there. A lot of people are getting sentinel interceptors. Hmm. Busy. Just want to see. I know I can buy a lot. I still have fifteen hundred fifty, but that means I still need to do some missions to get rewards from you. Ah, Helios. How are you doing? Ah, young one. You who still roam the boundaries of this universe. How I envy you. My time out in reality has long passed, but I do so miss it. Perhaps you might help an old soul and share the things you've seen. My heart aches for flowers, for plants. Have you any data? Sure. There you go. Thank you, little one. You have no idea what this means to me. Please take these nanites. They're nothing, but they're all I have now. Hmm. I will ponder what you have found me with a grateful heart, little one, but there is still an infinity of wonder out there to discover. Perhaps another day we may share more memories. Sure. Certainly. Ares, how are you doing? Traveler hopes to make progress. Traveler tests themselves. I will help. 
An exchange. Progress for progress. Or wealth, perhaps. Experience or materials. Both valid today. Gold nuggets. Sure. A fair exchange. We are matched. Three nanites. Three nanites. Well, thank you. There is something I want to check. Construction. 17. Okay, so I'll use up all of these. Livestock unit. Oh, we got some decorations, I guess. All right, nine left. All decal designs. Well, there's that. Most, mostly, I've got most of the construction. Alright. Do a light floor. I don't have enough for anything else. Other than this. I may as well. And one more. There we go. That is good. It's been a while since I've spoken to Polo and Nada. I'm just curious. Nada, it's been a long time. Traveler friend, you remembered us. Nada is grateful. For as long as Nada has, Nada will be grateful. We will remember you also. Thank you. Polo. Good to see you, Polo. Go further. Go faster. See it all. Have no regrets, friend. I am proud of you. Well, thank you. Well, then. I didn't have much to say. But. Hmm. One of these days, I'm going to have to do that. All right, I'm going to return. Let's go home. I need to find some more organic frigates. I think that would be absolutely wonderful. I'm home. Well, this has been an interesting system. Eventful. But I get I get a feeling that it doesn't want me here. But do I stay or do I go? I do have a destination. I do need to get to the center of the galaxy. 
seems that the boundary failure is correct. 